Anyway, we had to fight those guys just to activate this. Keep that in mind that if you try to go ahead and go for treasure or open up a door or something or where, you know, it pretty much prompts you to use A, your A button is useless. You're going to have to fight the enemies in front of you or around you. Which sucks big time, but, you know, you know. Funny thing is about that, uh, the little thing that just happened there, it formed that symbol that was currently blocking that thing. The elevator, I'm gonna assume. Still won't budge? Lightning and Saz are in here, obviously. So it seems like our main characters are coming together. I think the door is winning. Why didn't I listen? Uh, beg your pardon? It was me. This is my fault. Beg your pardon? Cover <laughs> your ears. Huh? Oh, oh, glass charge? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, hold on, hold on. Go for it! Make it happen! <laughs> I'm so sorry. Please let me in. Please? Hey! Wait. What? How'd you open it? I don't know. But just, just by you. simply being amazing. <laughs> or actually, amazingly kind and forgiving, well, remorseful. Oh, we get, they're talking about shrouds. Uh, forgot to mention those. Uh, certain shrouds do certain things. Deceptisol, uh, uses, it, it pretty much allows you to get preemptive strikes on whomever. Uh, we can go ahead and buy some, but in all honesty, I'd rather not. Do I even have some? Oh, I have one. Makes the party difficult for passing enemies to detect. Uh, and then aerosol or aerosol or something like that. It gives you certain buffs for your fight that you can very well get into. So you don't have to do any buffs to yourself. But eh, that's not important at the moment. Fuck! I couldn't get through them. Oh well. All right, we can continue on now. I need to actually check my inventory. The inventory will constantly do this for quite some time. Every time you get a new item. Uh, you just need to come in and look at it. What the hell? Oh, you have to look at each. We have two iron bangles and a bunch of other shit. Finding rod, power circle. Yeah, so everybody has at least one weapon, of course. And data logs, I'm gonna go through those eventually. <clears throat> but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and give lightning that. And I'm going to give Saz that. Seeing as how these two do not have very much health. Oh my god, come on guys. Preemptive strike? No. How'd they even see me? Oh, I guess I was already saw or noticed by another enemy, so it doesn't really matter. These guys are really weak, so... Just to quickly grab an item, it's no big deal. Ah, Phoenix Downs. Again. It doesn't really matter. Shit! Oh, god, that enemy was annoying. But anyway. I forgot what I was talking years. about now. God damn it. Nope, run. Run. Ah, oh, shit. Hey. Just when you don't when you don't want to fight in Final Fantasy, that's when they give you all the fights. Those and when you do want to around, fight, then that's when they take the longest to give them to you. Too. Except they'd probably be Lassie by now. Huh? Not even human anymore. Just pulselessy. Enemies of cocoon. Can't 
can't show him any mercy. Everybody seems really strung out on this pulseless sea thing. I mean, really strung out on it. Then again, I guess it's a crisis that's immediate. There's the next something. one. So let me guess, Snow gets one unavoidable battle? No? Ah. Yeah. Let me see if there's any treasure over here. Before I go do that... There's one. Two potions, sweet. I mean, right now, potions are actually really useful, but later on throughout the game, they become really, really useless. Um, because you'll be able to heal and all that shit, so it's no big deal. And of course, we can't activate the switch without taking these guys on first. And two hand grenades later, we're done. <laughs> all right. Pretty much showing the progress of everybody. Uh, obviously, if you see what's going to happen here, we're all going to eventually meet up, which Hang is on, never good. Your heroes on the way. You thought you were going up? I thought he was going to go up. <laughs> Hang on, baby. Your heroes on the way. Like our path is clear to go. Sweet. Because whatever he, he did. Here. Well. Calling himself a hero. He's coming our way. Well, what should I do? Tell him what you need to. But nothing I say will change what happened. We could just run away. <laughs> that sounds like a good idea. <laughs> Instead of facing my problems, run away from them. Wrong message, kid. Wrong message. Alright, now we're taking control of Vanille again. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, this only happens... a lot. Um, instead of switching between three characters, we're only going to be switching between, like, a group of two, or something like that. Wait, I already did that one. You, gonna, you guys gonna make me fight you? Oh, you guys made a clear path. Shit, I gotta stop fucking with the camera. Go, 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 fuck. Oh. I don't even know. I think, you know what, I think Vanille's weapon's like a, a fishing rod or something. <laughs> That's what I always think it is. It looks like she's going doing some serious fishing. There's another save point, just in case if you need it. Um, I guess I'll take on these two enemies and put this down in the chest. Alrighty. That's what she said. You're a nasty little kid. She's obviously in a hurry. She's got somewhere to be, and you want to talk about taking it slow. Psh, man, come on. Get with the program, little dude. Now we meet up with Snow, and we're taking on new enemies. 
So, let's see who we're controlling. We're controlling Snow now. Jesus. Just gonna throw hand grenades. Just throw them. Throw some more. That one. Standing next to your buddy. <laughs> Can I hit him with that fucking boomerang thing? How did you get in here? Uh, of course. You gotta leave. <sighs> okay, listen. Find some place to hide and keep quiet. Once I find Sarah, we'll all leave together. Uh, You'll be home in time for dinner. <laughs> you. Wait. Who's Sarah? My wife. Future wife, that is. She's a pulse, let's see. No. She's here somewhere, along with that foul sea. I gotta find her and set her free. What's wrong with you? Why do you want to help a sea? They're the enemy. Huh. How can you save a sea? And not. And not. That's insane! Say it. Say it. Say it. Oh, you fucking Probably. pussy. <laughs> But I gotta do something, right? I'll be back. Uh, Should we wait Why didn't you just him? say it? And hitch a ride? I'd rather go to Pulse! Why is this happening to me? When they found the foul sea the other day, we were just visiting Bodum. But the army took us. Threw us on that train. Because of that guy, Mom is... Why didn't you Probably tell him? Leave them alone. And he wants to help no. us see. <laughs> what type of dude would you be if you left us two kids alone? Hey again. Hey. Let's go with him. You gotta talk to him, hon. If you don't take this chance, you regret it forever. Kitchen. Let's go. Well, anyway. What's gotten into you, soldier? Thought you came for a fight. My sister. Oz, what the hell? We're picking fights, dude. She's a Lassie. What? A pulse Lassie? The Fel Sea has her captive, but I'll find her. Uh, is she still... Hey, what was her focus? When she became a Lassie, what did the Fel Sea order her to do? Uh, it wasn't blow up Cocoon or anything like that, was it? I didn't ask. Listen to me. When a person oh, gets cursed boy. by a foul sea, they become a lassie. And they get given a focus, right? How do I put this? If they don't carry it out, lassie end up as one of those things. What I'm saying is, if your sister's gone that far, I mean, she might still how, how can I? Oh, man. There's no way to turn a Lassie back into a human. Even if she completes her focus, there's no changing her fate. She'll live her life as a foul sea slave. <sighs> Don't make her suffer. Just say it! Any Lassie, anyone who might ever become a Lassie should be wiped off the face of Cocoon. It's people like you that started the purge in the first place. Uh-oh. It's technically the truth, I suppose. Let's see. 
Alright, anyway, these are Seath, but we're gonna ignore that guy. And we're gonna ignore these guys. And we're gonna ignore these guys. Uh, that big fucker's in the way. If I use Deceptisol, I'll be able to get past them, but I'm pretty sure they won't let me. Yeah, they won't let me. But we'll be able to take on a new enemy so I don't have to edit this out. Sweet. Gassed. A much more heavily armored sea, I suppose. <laughs> Oh shit, he hit us with fire. They're starting to use spells and shit now. Which is no good. That shit hurts. So uh, you just need to make sure you stay on top of your heels. It's not like he's doing much. He's not that difficult of an enemy. So. Just keep your wits about you. For whatever reason. It's not like this game has a hard mode or anything. I think it only has just one difficulty. Like most Final Fantasy should. Except for uh thirteen two, but we'll get into that when that when I get to that playthrough. And all honesty, I just can't believe I'm actually doing this playthrough right now. Anyway, we're not gonna access that save point, we're just gonna continue on. Looks like we're just about there. It's looking pretty grand and there's no other way out of here. So we got a straight path to walk. Now I'm going to use Deceptisol, seeing as how I have plenty of it. And we're just going to walk past each and every single one of them. Well, as far as they'll let me anyway. Yeah, we were only getting that far. <laughs> 